How's it going, guys? Hope everybody has a safe and happy new year. And uh, also, uh, just wanted to make this end of season video. Dallas Cowboys finish nine and seven and out of the playoffs in a team that that was talked about as being a Super Bowl contender but was terrible and never ever lived up to part this year and that and the losses to the Seahawks uh, the Chargers the Eagles the Falcons and the Broncos were games that the man the Cowboys just threw away and so too so too in the mo in the real disappointing losses to the Packers who were also out of the playoffs and the Rams a much improved Rams team and uh, it was a very disappointing season. It was, it was, there were a lot of really, there were a lot of injuries. Also, Ezekiel Elliott's suspension. However, there are no, there's no excuses because we have all this, we have so much talent, and yet this is what we get with all that talent. Pathetic. Coaches definitely, there needs to be some coaching changes in Dallas. We're going to have, we're going to have to really definitely get rid of Marinelli and Garrett. And Marinelli, his defense ain't working. And uh, so, now we got to get in, we got to get some free agents we gotta see what defensive players are on the market in the off season and try to draft some skill position receivers like like maybe in the draft we should draft Oklahoma State receiver James Washington to replace Des Bryant because Des is not he is nothing near what he was hyped up to be. He keeps dropping easy catches that he that he should catch and the Seahawks game really showed how bad how terrible he really is and how overpaid he is. Jerry's got to swallow his pride and step aside and hire a legit head coach and just concentrate on making money and being president and owner. Yeah, he can be president and owner all he wants, but he should really stand to the step aside, stand to the side and uh, just let the coach run the show like he did with Parcells. Now the Parcells experience the Parcells experiment didn't work. And also keep in mind that the the Cowboys, their roster when Parcells was here was not nearly as talented as this one is. And we're not getting anything out of the talent that we already have. A team that has and yet Prescott's going to have to Something needs to get him motivated because we better hire, we better get a backup quarterback who can put some fear of fear into Prescott's heart of losing his starting position because something needs to shake him and uh, his his supporting cast has also failed him on multiple occasions. And uh, th this year, pretty much, 
pretty much was epitomot was pretty much uh, went a lot the failure of the supporting cast of Prescott is uh, that his supporting cast let him down and yeah that there you see I'm glad we ended the season on a good note a very disappointing season that is out we're when we're out of the playoffs and uh, and not we're not going to the playoffs and so we finish yeah we finish on a good note which isn't saying much because the against Philadelphia or they were playing their scrubs because of the because it was the um, they already have the number one seed locked up and uh, we and uh, if they had played their starters we would have gotten destroyed but it's not saying anything there was no improvement with this team this game it just reaffirms how bad this team was how very disappointing this team was because against their first string starters we couldn't do anything and we just barely squeak it out against their second stringers that's the season for the Cowboys nine and seven and out of the playoffs it's terrible you gotta get better Dallas just have to it's going to be a major it's going to be a long off season see what they do in the off season pitiful